Facts Verse presents 10 Oddest Couples. Number 1. Married to the Eiffel Tower. Paris is known as the City of Love. Many people go to Paris to fall in love, and some actually do. Some people fall in love with objects rather than humans, like this female soldier did. She loved the Eiffel Tower so much that she went as far as marrying it. She even took its last name after the wedding. That's true love, and also one of the oddest couples in the world. Number 2. Extra Large and Extra Small Most people who are unusually tall hope you one day fall in love with someone with a similar stature. The tallest man in the world, Sultan Kosin, who is 8 feet 3 inches tall, did the exact opposite. On October 28, 2013, he married Merv Debo, who was only 5 feet 9 inches tall, which is much shorter than the average size woman. Clearly, love knows no heights. Regardless of their height difference, they make a cute couple. Plus, it's always great when your spouse looks up to you. Unfortunately, he keeps looking down on his wife. Number 3. Virtual Marriage Technology is always improving, and it often changes people's lives. This is true for a Japanese man who goes by his online moniker SAD9000. While playing the popular dating simulation game Love Plus in 2009, he met a girl named Nini Enigasaki. The two characters fell in love while playing the game, and they were married live on Japan's version of YouTube. The newlyweds honeymooned in Guam, taking pictures installed in his Nintendo DS at various landmarks. Number 4. Sharing with a Friend Mother of two, Maria Butsky couldn't decide who she wanted to be with when she got pregnant with her second child. She loved her husband, Paul, but she also loved her boyfriend, Peter Grumman. Rather than getting a divorce, she moved Peter into the home with her husband and her two daughters, Amy and Laura, in 2012. After living together, the two men became such good friends they had no problem sharing the same woman. Number 5. Love is a Roller Coaster Ride A roller coaster called the 1001 in Pennsylvania had such a great impact on a New York woman named Amy Wolf, she fell in love with it. She admits that she rides the 1001 at least 30 times when she visits. She's never had a boyfriend, but she has had previous love affairs with the Twin Towers, model spaceships, and a banister. Number 6. The Awesome Me Lu Yi, a 44-year-old man, admits that he is a bit narcissistic. His love for himself ran so deep, he decided to marry himself on New Year's Eve 2007. He had a life-size cardboard cutout of himself who he exchanged vows with. It's unclear exactly how a divorce would work out if the marriage doesn't last. Can you have irreconcilable differences with yourself? Number 7. Loving the Animals the love and loyalty that we get from dogs is often stronger than the love we get from humans. Amanda Rogers saw this, and she married her dog named Sheba. Sheba was not Amanda's first husband. She was married to a man for 20 years, but the marriage fell apart and the couple got a divorce. Amanda decided to take a different approach and married her loyal, faithful, loving dog. So let me see if I understand this. She got rid of her first husband because he was a dog and now she's married to a dog? Number 8. Love Your Animals A woman in India named Bimbala Das fell in love with and married a king cobra. She believed that the snake loved her, too, because he always came out when she brought milk to him. The people in her village welcomed the union, believing it would bring good fortune. During the ceremony, the snake refused to come out of the anthill where it lived, so a brass snake replica stood in during the ceremony. Bimbala's mother believes that the daughter is meant to be with the cobra, and she credits the snake for healing her daughter when she was sick. And come on, guys, let's face it. There's no way we're going to be able to compete with something that looks like that. Am I right? Number 9. Real Life Twilight Lovers Aero Draven and Leah Benninghoff have taken their love to a whole other level, and they drink each other's blood once a week. The couple met on a dating website and both embraced the goth lifestyle. 
They decided to get married on Halloween in a gothic ceremony, and they say that drinking each other's blood each week is more intimate than having sex. Arrow got Leah to try it, and since then she has stated that they have a deeper connection. Talk about being married to a blood relative. Number 10. The World's Youngest Groom In the town of Zimhungwe in South Africa, a nine-year-old groom named Sanella Masalila kissed his 62-year-old bride named Helen Shabangu. The wedding was not a legal wedding, but a ceremony where over 100 attended to see the bride walk down the aisle to her groom. Helen is already married to a man close to her age, but she married the young boy because she believes that the boy's deceased ancestors told her to marry him. They do not wear wedding rings or live together, but they have been making their wedding an annual celebration. Subscribe for more!